with us magical family. This is Anna Robertson and Just Whisper. I am a highly psychic medium. Since I was very young, I could remember most of my past lives. And I am working side by side with spirit. I feel blessed for your presence. Don't forget to subscribe, give me a like. And of course, I do tarot here on YouTube as well. So my sunshines, before we continue with this new pick a card, I want to thank today's sponsors, Keen. Just in case, guys, you don't know what Keen is yet, Keen is an online psychic site full of vetted psychics and intuitives that are going to be able to deliver to you any type of question concerning love, money, career. What's great about Keen is that it is 24-7, so you will always have somebody online. I think this is very important because sometimes we feel the urge to talk with a good psychic, a good tarotist, a good medium, and it's so important to get to those beautiful, magical, gifted souls like you can find in Kin, so that they can really help you in that precise moment. It is very easy to register in Kin. you just have to fill in with your name, your birth date, and then you have to answer some short questions that Kin is going to ask you in order for them to deliver to you to those psychics that are most suitable for your needs. And what's even better that the moment you register, you are going to receive weekly promotions, coupons and discounts. So you will always save money in Kim. I want to tell you guys about my own experience. And many of you, you know that I moved from Madrid to Andalusia and I'm moving back again to Madrid in one week. I'm living in one week. So, and I have to say, and I'm going to be completely sincere, my last psychic told me that I was coming back to Madrid. I did not expect it, but I felt suddenly, my soul felt the need to come back to Madrid, to move again. And he told me that, and it was a hundred true words. So that's why, my loves, I recommend you that when you find your psychic or your psychics, maybe you resonate with more than one psychic from Kim, to stick with those psychics or psychic because the more they know you, the stronger the bond, the stronger the relationship through time, the better the predictions will be. And it has just happened to me again. So if you want to try out my link, which is trykeen.com slash Anna Robertson, you will get to this incredible offer for the first 10 minutes for just $1.99 is nothing. <laughs> More affordable than my private readings. <laughs> so if you just want to spend 10 minutes, it's fine. If you want to continue, don't worry, because if you're chatting or you can call them, it's always going to stop when you have reached your 10 minutes and they won't, they're going to tell you exactly how much you will spend per minute, which is not at all expensive. So my sunshines, again, if you want to try out my Kin link, which is down below in the description and in the comment section, it's trykin.com slash Anna Robertson. You will have the first 10 minutes for just $1.99. It's nothing. And I'm sure you will be very happy like I am. So my beauties, thank you so much for sticking around. And thank you again, Kin, for sponsoring today's video. Loves, let's go to the cards. So hello again, my love. So let's see about that soulmate that it's meant for you, that it's your destiny. I think I have talked about this in many of my readings that we have many soulmates and not only loving soulmates, but within the loving soulmates, we can connect with several soulmates. But I always have felt that this very specific soulmate meant for all of us, that it's truly I don't want to say our other half because we are all a unity and the other person should be a unity as well. Um, but yes, I feel that and I perceive this a very special and magical soulmate for all of us. So my beauties, you know how it works and if you don't know yet, you have to choose between one of these three groups. Maybe you feel, you feel attracted to more than one group, it's fine. You can check the timing and the groups always in my description. And this is group number one with aventuring. Group number one with aventuring. Group number one 
this is group number two with the pyramid of clear quartz or crystal quartz and this is group number three with parite Don't forget to subscribe, give me a like if you want to support my work and if you like the way I work. And again, if you really want a very affordable and economical reading, you just have to spend less than $2, you get 10 minutes. And if you want to continue, it's not going to be expensive at all. And you have an incredible list of psychics over there. You have my link down below. It's trykeen.com slash Anna Robertson, as I said before. My sweeties, let's get started. Beautiful, magical souls. So welcome group number one. Let's see about that soulmate that is meant for you. So what I'm perceiving when I'm getting the image and when I'm getting the adventuring, this is somebody that it's very adventurous. This is somebody very passionate because I'm watching the sun at the back. Reminds me of Asia, if I tell you the truth, and reminds me of fire element. I feel that this person is really passionate, is working to make a reality that he is going to be able to win a lot of money out of his passion or out of her passion because this is the representation of energy guys i know that some of you you're a man or woman that you want to meet a woman it's fun it's just a representation of energy so your that very special soulmate that it's meant for you is waiting for you i am listening and while your soulmate is waiting they are doing a lot of stuff to entertain themselves because they don't want to suffer waiting and waiting and waiting and not meeting you. Maybe that has happened for some of you. You have been waiting so much for this very magical connection that maybe you have felt recently that you have missed moments um, feeling at peace or having fun with yourself or with others. So I feel that your soulmate it's going to teach you, when both of you guys are going to be together, your soulmate is going to teach you that whatever you want to do for you, it's fine. I feel that your soulmate is, is very independent. I feel that your soulmate, when he or she was really young, they were very rebellious. They were like kind of free spirit, different. Maybe some people thought of your soulmate like, oh my gosh, he's or oh, she's so different. But at the same time, they have that energy of um, wisdom, of I am beautiful inside and outside and I know. I feel that your future... Oh, I was going to say future spouse. Okay, for many of you, it's your future spouse. I feel that your soulmate, it's very confident whether your soulmate is really young right now or whether they are in past the 40s, 50s or 60s. I feel this is a person that it's very confident and I feel that they have always been different and they, ha they have always felt very proud of being different. We see, the, we see the character looking straight forward. Normally when we meet somebody and they, ca and they, can, they can look, well, he looks like he's staring. <laughs> this is the sign of something else, the way you, you guys are going to meet. But when somebody is looking at your eyes and they don't feel uncomfortable looking at the eyes of people, this is an extrovert. Or at least this is somebody very confident because it could be a mix of introvert and extrovert for some of them. And the way he's staring to the front, this is telling me that this person is going to go very straightforward towards you. Whether it's a man or a woman, they're going to be very clear and straightforward from the beginning. If they want to have something with you, they will tell you in the beginning. If they don't, they are not sure because of whatever reasons, they will tell you in the beginning. But the spirits are telling me that if you if you guys are not going to go out since the first moment you guys meet, give that person a chance. If you feel a gut that um, this could work out, okay? Normally I don't say this because I'm the kind of person that believes that if someone, somebody tells you, well, if somebody tells you, I don't want anything serious, that's not your soulmate, no. But maybe some soulmates, again, because you're very independent, free soul, they're used to, to really, they're, I mean, they like to be with people, but they're used to go by themselves, to do stuff, they're very adventurous. They don't need anyone. I'm not telling you by this that, <laughs> 
your soulmate is not going to be with you, of course, and a hundred percent, but I feel that they want to make sure before they step forward. And that's why they're staring at you. I feel that on the first date, I feel it's going to be in a nice restaurant, in a nice meal, nice dinner. It could be some of you a nice coffee and a cake or a biscuit or a sandwich. And I feel your soulmate looking straight to your eyes. And some of you even, I'm listening from spirit, you're even going to begin to sweat because you're going to be a little bit nervous. You're not used to this type of connection. I mean, the way they look at you, your soulmate, the, the way he or she is going to look at you is going to go like, whoa, whoa. oh my gosh, <laughs> stop it. I feel that some of you, you're going to say, stop it, <laughs> stop it, please. So my sunshine, let's, this is, this is getting very interesting already in group number one. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I love when these things, when, when, have you realized guys that there are certain days and I'm recording today that it's 22 of second of 22. This is a very powerful day. So I'm sure this is the sign from the spirit team that don't worry, your soulmate is very close. Oh, you have just met your soulmate. I feel for, for you guys, group number one in general, because again, this is a general reading, this person has not arrived yet, but it's close. Yes, six of swords, page of cups. Okay. I'm going to shuffle before I start channeling and everything. The sun. Wow, six of pentacles. Wow, what a change. Wow. Okay. I feel that your soulmate has been abandoned or is adopted or felt abandoned when they were a kid. And that's why they left their hometown, they left their city, they left even their country. They went for adventure. And I understand why they are so strong, your soulmate is so strong and so independent and such a free soul. Because life forced your soulmate to be like that. Not completely. I mean, life can lead us to a path, but it is us who choose. And your soulmate, whether it's a man or a woman, they felt that it was better they left and they started a new life. What I'm feeling, this is part and it's going to repeat with you in the sense that both of you guys, you're going to feel that it's better for both of you to live in a certain area, in a certain city, in a certain village, in a certain country, because you feel it's, it's the best for both of you. So what he did when he was young or when she was young, leaving behind almost everything because they wanted a new life, they wanted to start something fresh, something new, something with good energy, that's going to, to happen with both of you guys as well, with the Six of Swords and Page of Cups. Page of Cups, this is somebody romantic. This is somebody that, again, is going to offer you something fresh, something beautiful, something nice, something uh, nurturing, something that it's going to be protected always by your soulmate. I feel that your soulmate is going to take care a lot of you and of this relationship. And it could be that some of you, you're planning to go to a different career, to go to a different company, to go to different universities, study in a university in a different state, or you're planning to go to a different, to a foreign place because your soul calls you to go there because you feel that your soulmate is over there or you go, or you guys could be that you're going to meet through a, through traveling through moving, okay? Maybe you have just moved or maybe you're going to move. And this is the confirmation from Spirit that you're very close to achieve that magical soulmate. This is somebody that it's, again, straightforward, confident. If I'm watching the character here, I see somebody very confident. The way he puts his arm over here, the way he positions the legs, the way he offers the cup to you. And again, I'm watching a restaurant. And coffee.
Oh, I started coughing. <laughs> so again, it could be that coughing, it could be a sign <laughs> over there. Okay, it's the typical scene I'm watching that when you're very comfortable with somebody and you start laughing and you're eating or drinking at the same time and you spill that out and both of you guys, you start laughing and laughing and laughing. That's what the spirits were showing me. So again, your future spouse is offering you a big cup, a big cup, a big love, not something small. Again, I tell you that your person is very independent. If they're starting out something with you, it's because he or she is meant for you. Like the title says, it's your destiny. You are your soulmate's destiny and the other way around. And what I love about your soulmate is that they are very bright. They are very intelligent, very straightforward. They are very connected with their inner child. It could be that some of them, I am listening, could be that some of them, they are divorced and they have a child. Okay, could be, it could be. Because again, this is a general reading and if I'm listening that from spirit. But again, we see the red passion, red velvet, I am listening. The sun, summer, sunflowers growing. This relationship, it's going to grow always. Both of you, you're going to grow old together. Both of you, you're always going to have a lot of fun. And with the white horse, this is talk, uh, talking about purity. This is going to be a pure relationship. I'm not telling you sometimes there will be ups and downs, but I don't feel it's going to be like a really big up or big down. I feel that both of you guys are going to be quite stable emotionally, whether you're passing through an obstacle or not. I see both of you guys being quite stable. Life, it's ups and downs. That's, that's life. <laughs> but I tell you that your future spouse, oh, again, I'm saying future spouse. Okay. <laughs> your, your soulmate and your future spouse. <laughs> You are, you are meant to, both of you, to, to live I am listening in a very luxurious way. That is, that's why the Six of Pentacles. This is somebody very bright, very, very quick. The, their mind goes really quick. Look, there's somehow, I, I have not noticed about these features and, until I was connecting for you guys. Look at the sun, how he's staring to the front. Can you see it? Beautiful synchronicity. <laughs> red, red. <laughs> white, white. <laughs> wow. And here it's so amazing because she's the illustrator that she, uh, well, we are preparing a tarot together. We're almost done. And it's called Cup Canvas. Look at that. Cup. <laughs> Cup. Isn't this amazing? The synchronicities. Oh my gosh. This is crazy. Wow. And yes, both of you guys, you're going to make a lot of money. So much money that you're going to be, to be able to help your families, friends, communities, people, clients. I feel that both of you guys, you're going to become a very powerful team together. I am listening from spirit. I'm so happy for both of you. your group number one your soulmate it's somebody one of a kind they are not from the media i think you've never met somebody so brave like your soulmate you're going to be very surprised about all of the stuff they have passed through even some of them they were abducted or they passed through one family to another to another really some of them they had a very tough past okay maybe the country where they were raised born was not easy to become a woman or even to be a man Look, number three, masters, the North Node, the star, the star is guiding you. Again, I'm watching Aquarius for some of you or some of them, the tree of life. Again, both of you guys, you're meant to become stars together, okay? You're going to become a very powerful team in order to guide mankind or to help people with a certain product that it's going to allow people to live a, an easier life. Or maybe it's a product, a specific product that it's good for kids. It could be maybe specific or maybe you are going to help. Uh, you're going to create um, beautiful homes for elders 
or people that are people that need help economically. I feel that both of you guys, you're going to do a lot of donations. You're going to invest in many projects together and that's going to allow you again the tree growing both of you guys we see here the red again more red and the green i see both of you guys working together in a in a very beautiful and magical sync yes like synchronized like very harmonious way i sense a lot of sensuality as well here in group number one Okay. I was just going to get one. I'm going to get just one. The Observer, yes. I feel that, uh, I was going to say the future spell. <laughs> I feel that your soulmate, again, has the ability, has psychic abilities. It could be that some of you, you do tarot, you are psychic, you're not a psychic, a clever young, and I see wings, so this is letting me know that some of them, they have traveled a lot, or it could be that some of them are pilots or air hostesses, or they work in a cruise, or they are working in a company that they, they provide this service of a transportation of money, could be. It could be a transportation of products, okay? Even I'm listening, some of them, they are working in a bank or something related to the bank or they're providing services to the bank. It could be even technology. But the observer, this is somebody that it's very good at observing you <laughs> and observing people as well. Toads, tools, growth. Yes, a lot of growth, number 44, a lot of growth. Uh, if we sum four and four, it's eight. I, I tell you guys that both of you guys, you're going to become a very powerful team. I see a lot of luxury. I see a great lifestyle. I see a lot of abundance. I see a lot of joy together. I see a great team together. And because she's hiding one of the eyes, this is letting me know that you still don't know your soulmate yet, but here she's really close. Both of you guys, again, what I, what I said before, you're going to grow old together. <laughs> That's so beautiful. Okay. Libra, new moon in Libra. Know you are loved. So this person is going to love the way you are. They're going to love the way you speak, the way you move, the way you make love, the way you kiss, the way even you get angry. Because I feel that <laughs> if you're going to get angry sometimes, they're going to love it. <laughs> it's not that they don't take you seriously, but I feel your soulmate has passed through so much that they don't take those little problems like real obstacles you know what i mean maybe some of you you're going to be a little bit defensive in those scenes be careful with that again if you see your soulmate you think he or she's not taking taking you seriously it's not that they take you seriously they are completely in love with you crazy in love with you but they come from a very tough past a very tough one and that's why what maybe what you see as a problem right now they are not going to see it as a problem. And they like you so much that even angry, they are crazy. I mean, they just want to make love to you or to give you a hug or to get close to you. You know what I mean? Again, maybe you have to tell, <laughs> to tell your soulmate, please, when I'm angry or when there's a misunderstanding, please don't appear like you're not giving a damn because <laughs> I get more angry. So have that conversation with your soulmate. But again, I don't feel that both of you guys are going to to argue a lot. The Libra, it's balanced. So again, a very balanced relationship and not many ups and downs. Very, very balanced. Everything, everything good. It's like everything growing, money growing, love growing, it's attraction growing, everything growing. A new moon in Aries, go for it. Yes. And this is somebody, your soulmate, that goes for it. He or she, when they meet you, and when they know, again, if both of you guys, you're going to start knowing one and another, or maybe you are quicker than your soulmate, give it time. Because maybe on the third date, he or she's going to tell you your soulmate. 
I want, I really want to go out with you. But it's not like, oh, I want to go out with you, let's see. No, if they say that, they want to be with you. So that's why if some of you, you're a little bit impulsive, impatient, and if on the first day they don't tell you the stuff that you want to listen to, control yourself, breathe. <laughs> okay, my sunshine, come on. You're doing amazing. The F boy, the devil, again, a lot, a lot, a lot of attraction between you guys. But I feel because they recognize you, your soulmate recognizes you, but they're not going to tell you everything on the first date. Or maybe it could be that they're waiting for one month to pass by. Again, remember where they're coming from. Don't, <laughs> this is, maybe it's not for all of you guys, but this is a specific message that I'm listening from spirit. Don't. F it up <laughs> because you are comparing this person with others that you felt very strong connection. Okay, this is very important. <laughs> okay, just calm down, enjoy the dates, and in less than one month, you're going to see. Don't worry, don't worry with that. Okay. Well. Tenderness, so beautiful, the couple. Show compassion and forgive what needs to be forgiven, what I was talking about before, okay? And what I was telling you that your soulmate has passed through so much that they are not going to, to create drama out of problems or obstacles, okay? That's your person. And I feel that's good for you. Okay, my loves, this is somebody very tender. This is somebody that is going to, again, to take care of you. Very tender, nice hugs. And I feel that this person, because of the devil too, they have a lot of experience in sex, okay? This is somebody that has a lot of experience in the past. If some of you, you don't have, you merely have experience or you don't have experience, don't worry, it's fine, it's fine. The connection is going to be amazing between the two. And kangaroo, it could be that some of you, you're from Australia or this person, is highly connected to Australia and Asia. I was listening before. Some, well, I am watching a little bit of, of USA as well. Kangaroo, courage, you're being tested. Have, have faith and stand in your truth, okay? I feel that this message is for all of you guys that you're feeling lately that maybe you have been feeling a little bit like somebody's testing you if you're ready for this connection, but I tell you that the kangaroo, if we imagine a kangaroo like standing still, they're not moving, right? Maybe lately you have been feeling that this is not moving. Where's my soulmate? Where's my soulmate? But suddenly when the kangaroo stands up and starts to jump, 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 it goes faster, 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 faster. And this is telling me about the beginning of the relationship as well. It, it will start us very slowly, calm, Okay, and then quickly, quickly, like the whale. The whale can, can swim very deep. So this is going to be a very deep connection. Both of you guys, you're going to start slowly, but steady, and then relationship will go faster. Okay, my beauties. Nice. Happiness, yes, oh my gosh, this is so beautiful, yes. And this reminds me, I didn't tell you guys, I think because of the sun, summertime could be a possible, those three months of the summer, summertime, that both of you, you could meet, okay? And February, okay, for some of you, it's February, we are in February, it could be of next year or summer. Let me shuffle another one, whoops. Okay, career and love. Some of you, you could meet through your career, through a trip that you have to make because of your career. Or they have to do that, okay? Again, what did I tell you before? Yes, thank you, Spirit. I forgot. You, both of you guys, you're going to be a very beautiful loving relationship and you're going to work together. Yeah, you're going to be very happy. And I feel that in February, when you guys as well, this is another message, when you guys are going to be together, we see the, the wind blowing, things are going to get faster. I feel that both of you guys, you're very good at manifesting. 
Okay. Stuff you will be taking care of in difficult times. What did I tell you guys? Your soulmate is going to take care of you. I mean, they are very good at taking care of themselves, so it does not surprise me. It could be that some of you, you could meet through your career, somebody from the staff. It could be. Star, yes, guaranteed success. I'm so happy for all of you guys. And remember that we saw, and what incredible synchronicities you have, guys. Look at this star. Both of you guys, you're going to become a star. Maybe one... I don't know how to be sincere. I don't think your soulmate is a star already. It could be that they're starting to go viral or they're starting to be known as whatever they're doing right now. But what a beautiful synchronicity. You, both of you guys, this relationship is going to be completely successful. And I am listening from spirit that your soulmate is always going to tell you, I feel good today. <laughs> and I feel that many of you, you're going to laugh like, when do you, when, my love, when you don't feel good? Because that's the, again, this is very, very, very intelligent. Your soulmate is very emotional, very intelligent. And if they perceive that you're having a bad day, they're going to switch your energy. They're going, really, they're, I think that they would be amazing as coach, coach, because they're, they're really good. Look, crossroads, success, career, and this is me. <laughs> okay. If I'm appearing here, it's because maybe some of you, you're from YouTube, or this could be a YouTuber. Or maybe some of you, you're doing the same like me, or maybe your soulmate is doing something very similar into spirituality matters. And this is balance, okay? The crow and the pigeon. And this is, um, for me, the representation as well. And that's why I did that picture of magic, of manifestation. Okay, it could be that some woman, they're called Hannah, Anna. Okay, and crossroads. I feel that, again, some of you, you're going to feel in the beginning that, oh, I'm not sure this is my soulmate. They don't seem to like me so much like I like them. Give it time. In less than one month, you, again, give it time if you feel that's your soulmate. Not the one that tells you, I don't want anything with you, or not the one that does not answer your your texts or does not call you. No, that's not your soulmate. I mean, if he or she's showing interest and you still don't see what's going to happen, give it time, okay? Because it's going to become a success. And both of you guys, you're going to be such a successful party, I'm listening, couple together. Wow. Oops, I'm moving this. And let's, sorry, that's my Leonidas snoring. It could be that some of them, they're called Leo, or they are a Leo. Okay. Look at that. More flowers, happiness, riding together, growing old together, this relationship growing, everything growing. Oh my gosh. Look at that. He or she is represented in this energy that they are very romantic. They are looking up again, high self-esteem, very confident and waiting for you. Ah, oh, look at that. Oh my gosh. Pure representation that your soulmate is going to adore to take care of you. Maybe, maybe preparing the meal. Maybe, I don't I think that even all of them, they, they like to wash the dishes, to clean their home. Really, they, they, like, they like to do all of that stuff that you don't like to do. <laughs> so good for you. Allow yourself <laughs> to, yes, to be loved like that. Wow. And more red, passion. Fire element it could be Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. Wow, group number one. I have loved it. I hope you too. <laughs> if that's the case, guys, please don't forget to subscribe. Give me a like. And again, if you want even better, a more specific reading for less than $2, you can use my link, trykeen.com slash Anna Robertson. The first 10 minutes you get for just $1.99, an incredible reading. I am not in King, but I, I work with King side by, well, as a partnership, yes, because I want to, I want to offer 
economical readings as well. Not, not only mine that are more expensive, okay? So all of you guys, you can receive messages easily. Okay, my loves? Mwah! Kisses from Spain. <laughs> Bye. Adios. Welcome group number two. I am already listening a lot of stuff from Spirit about your soulmate, the one that it's meant for you. Group number two. This soulmate, I feel whether it's a he or a she, it's going to fall in love with you like crazy. It's going even to look like platonic, platonic kind of connection. What I'm feeling again, if you don't resonate with the messages that I'm listening from spirit, choose another group. But I feel that many of you, or maybe you are a little bit burned out because you did not have good experiences concerning love. Or maybe some of you, you're still in a relationship or a connection that you have not cut it yet, or you have just come out of a divorce or you're just about to divorce. I feel that this person, is going and that's why he's just about to to send that arrow towards you it's i am watching like cupid like valentine um it could be that valentine could be an important uh, sign for some of you but i feel that that your summit knows exactly from second one or <laughs> second two or third <laughs> that they want to be with you but what I'm feeling from this side, from all of you guys, for whatever reasons, because you want to go slowly, you're not sure, you're a little bit on defensive mode, you are still in a relationship, you're still addicted to someone, you still have to overcome the past, you, you want to be single yet, but you're a little bit curious, that's why you're, you're in this reading. I feel that they're going to, your soulmate is going to make a lot of effort towards you, okay, a lot of effort. Okay, my sunshines, let's shuffle some tarot. Okay, so, oops, this is falling very quickly. Two of swords and the tower. What did I tell you guys? One of the two, and I feel it's all of you guys, one of the two is not sure, uh, is not putting, it's not putting, uh, you're not going to put things easy for your soulmate, but they don't care. <laughs> your soulmate is like, I don't care what you tell me. You are mine. You are my soulmate. You are my future wife. You're my future husband. I know it. And many of you, you're going to go like, mm, I'm not sure. Or maybe some of you, you're going to be between two people. It could be. And what I was telling about the tower, some of you, you have just come out of a very tough and toxic relationship, marriage, and that's why you're a little bit open to love, but no, yes and no, yes and no. So I feel that your, your soulmate, that's, the, that's inside of the soul contract between both of you guys, so don't worry about that, don't feel bad about it. If that's what you feel, it's fine, they know it, okay, they're prepared for it. Wow, a page of cups came in the group number one as well. Three of wands and seven of pentacles. What I was telling you, my loves. Oh my gosh. Aren't spirits amazing? I love it when I channel and the cards are the confirmation of what we have been channeling for you guys. So as we were saying, they really know they want to be with you. I feel that your soulmate recognizes you, but for whatever reason, your circumstances, you don't recognize your... That's something that is meant for you. But don't worry, they're going to make such a big effort <laughs> that it's impossible not to fall in love with your soulmate, okay? And again, three of wands, they are planning ahead. They are planning. How are they going to conquer you? How your soulmate is going to conquer you? How are they going to win your heart? What things, what plans can you do together? I feel that for many of you, you're going to be together in 2023, but I feel that for most of you guys, you're going to meet, if you have not met already, you're going to meet very soon. It, it Maybe even it could be between three months and 2023. And this is telling me that they are, again, they're going to make a big effort to conquer your heart, to conquer your soul, because they know, their, their soul knows it's you. But again, this is your soul contract. Both of you guys, you talked before incarnating and you said, okay, I will not recognize you. Don't worry, I will conquer you. Okay. <laughs> so very, very, <laughs> it's funny. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, my sunshines. Let's shuffle some oracle.
Wow, number nine, and the flowers. Again, a lot of romance, a lot of gifts. I feel that your soulmate is going to bring you a lot of gifts, bring you, I am listening heaven on earth. I feel that your soulmate is going to try to conquer you in any type of way that they know. I am even, some of them, I am looking through spirit eyes, like they are searching for information, they are planning a beautiful date, they are planning a beautiful trip, they are always planning, 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 planning. They are planning because again, they know they want you, your soulmate wants you. And I feel that in three months, no more, no less. All of you guys, you're going to feel, oh my gosh, I cannot believe how much in love I am with this person. I mean, I was not interested. I did. I was not sure. And I have just um, came out from a divorce, a breakup, or I, um, I was very burned out. And look at us now. I even feel that many people are going to watch you guys going out, hanging out, and they're going to tell you how many years you have been together. Are you going to go like, mm, this is our second date? <laughs> or this is the third month or second month together? They're going, and people are going to tell you, wow, you guys, you f it feels like you are so comfortable with one another. I think that this person is going to help you to feel safe. And I don't feel group number two. Partners in the past knew how to make you feel safe, okay? Maybe because they cheated or they lied or they were rough or maybe because they were not the way that was most suitable for you. The creator, yes, of course. The stick, <laughs> the arrows. Yes, this is a person, your soulmate that is meant for you is the creator. They know they are the creator of their own reality. That's why they know they're going to, your soulmate knows, that he or she is going to conquer you. Your soulmate knows they're going to conquer you because they are creator. They are very good with the law of attraction, with the law of assumption. They have read a lot of books about how to attract, how to manifest, how to create, how to alchemize any type of situation. And again, I tell you, this soulmate, again, is meant for you and they're going to do it very well. <laughs> I think that if you want to meet a man, he has very strong arms. And if you want to be a, meet a woman, uh, they have like a very, yes, I sense like a very beautiful build up body, like a very nice body, whether it's a man or a woman, a man or a woman. Yes, dragon, power, 11, 11, awakening. This is a very powerful manifestator. They are, you're going to be, and it's funny because you're going to be quite amazed with this soulmate. I mean, you sense there's a connection, but you're going to be amazed, group number two, at the incredible leap of, I am not sure, I don't want anything, and suddenly, oh my gosh, I am completely in love with you. That's what I sense. And if they have the dragon, or some of you guys, you have the dragon, and this is letting me know that both of you guys, you're very good at manifesting. But look at the dragon and look at the lady, whether it's a man or a woman. I feel that they are, this soulmate is going to meet you in a moment of your life that you are feeling really tired energetically. You came out of a battle that left you like very tired. It could be that some of you, you got fired at work or you didn't pass some tests or you, were, you came out of a very rough and karmic relationship, marriage. And he or she is going to be there for you. They are going to help you build up again. They're going to help you feel good. They're going to help you to restore yourself. I am listening. That's wonderful. Yes, that's true love. Not only to be for the, for the good moments. Yes, the Hermit and Ace of Swords. I tell you that they're going to help you to find yourself again. For some of you, it's not for all of you guys, but I feel that some of you, you feel a little bit lost right now. Or you're not sure if you're doing something wrong because you keep manifesting the same type of person in love. 
don't worry, that's over. I feel that that karma is over. And I feel you strong again. And I feel you that this person is really going to fight for you. And it's going to show you how beautiful, how special you are inside and outside. You're somebody very unique and you deserve somebody that really loves you good, not bad, good. And I feel that, <laughs> sorry, I'm saying it like that. And I feel that again, that this is a fighter. This person is going to show you that you can overcome any type of obstacle, okay? Beautiful. Yeah, loyalty and wisdom, totally. Wow, look at that. This person is going to be completely loyal to you. Faithful, loyal. I feel that both of you guys, you're going to even to become best friends, not only a partner. Even it could be that some of you, you're going to start as friends and they're going to win you as time, win you over as time passes by. And I feel with wisdom, some of you, maybe you could uh, meet through studies, through a course, through a webinar, through a workshop, through a retreat. It could be as well, spiritual retreat, some of you. Even I'm listening some music concert, music. I am watching, I am listening the word music. Okay, and we see a lot of books. This is somebody that has read a lot, loves to read, loves to know. This is somebody very wise. And I didn't say it before, guys. This is somebody younger than you. I didn't say it, thank you, Spirit, because they, they just, they told me before I was going to record for all of you, but I forgot because this is challenging, guys. <laughs> this is challenging. Yes, your soulmate is younger than you. Even it could be quite young, quite young, okay? Sorry, I have this, okay. Yes, the yoga inst oh my gosh, twice the hem, I oh know, the hierophant. Okay, this is marriage. I feel that this person, again, whether it's a he or she, they have a very beautiful, 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 beautiful body. Very beautiful body. Yeah. I think this is the type of person that when they, when, I, I'm trying to be polite. When they, t imagine guys, you're going to be more intimate. When they take out their clothes, you're going to go like, wow. <laughs> They didn't seem like that with their clothes on. Okay, you're going to be surprised with many things from your soulmate. I think, again, they're going to conquer you in such a beautiful and magical way that it's impossible not to fall in love with this person. And look at the back prosperity. I feel that one of the two, it's going to help the other one with money, okay? If you're dealing with debts or if you're struggling with money, if finding a job or being in a job that you're happy, he or she will help you. If it's the other way around, I think that you will do the same too for that soulmate. But I don't feel that both of you guys, you are getting together because of necessity of interest. No, the only interest I see, I like you, I want to be with you. Okay, beautiful. I am listening again, and guys, this is important. Karma is over, karma is over, karma is over. Don't worry, okay? Don't worry, my love. Leaf cutter ant, army of life, and look at that. Just about to fight for this love. Ask for help, seek support, you are not alone. Again, your soulmate is going to teach you that, like the ants, when we are a team, we can handle anything in life. Allow yourself, please help, please allow me to help you. Allow me to love you. Allow me to do whatever you need right now. This is the sense of the energy that I'm feeling from your soulmate. Okay, and I feel that your soulmate knows a lot of people. A lot of people loves your soulmate. It could be that even some of them could be a celebrity or somebody that it's well known, or at least well known in the community. This is somebody very lovable. Okay, no one is going to tell you anything negative about your soulmate. Maybe if somebody does, it's because they feel envy. <laughs> that's 
That's the only reason I can think of. Okay, my sweeties. And let's shuffle some images. Oh, beautiful picnic. Again, I tell you that they're going to, they're really going to prepare dates like no one has ever done for you. Wow, this is so beautiful. Wow, very nice. Had to stop for one second. I sense the kisses like really slowly in the beginning. Maybe other times very quickly. It sounds like very passionate, very smooth. Passionate, smooth. Depends on the mood of both of you guys or how you're feeling. Look at that. This came out in group number one. It could be that some of them, they are hairdressers or you could meet on a day that you go to cut your hair or to change the color of your hair. Again, this is telling me that probably your um, your soulmate is very highly creative, very caring, and I think that they are quite tall. Okay, whether it's a he or she, it's quite well. If it's a she, she's shorter than you. If it's a he, taller than you. I am feeling yes. Oh my gosh, so interesting the synchronicity with group number one because group number one came out a guy looking to the front and this one to the back. So again, I feel that one, so many of you, you're still recovering from something from the past. For me, the past is the left side. For me, the future is the right side. Some of you, you're still recovering. And that's why it's like, you're not, it's like, I am listening from spirit. Look up, look what you have in front of you. Can't you, don't you realize he's very special? She's very special. And I am listening this song. I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> I don't sing very well, but... Uh, you know that song like na 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 you will find me time after time na 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 guys could you tell me what's the name of the song so some people can group number two can search for it okay time after time time after time so again time it's going to help your soulmate win your heart okay this is somebody that it's worth it, completely worth it like you. But again, I feel that many of you, you have cleaned so much karma, not only concerning love, but in general, many stuff in your life has not gone really well. You may be, some of you, you felt you were not very lucky, but spirits wants me to remind you that it was that if you chose to clean a lot of karma from family, okay? So don't worry about that. My loves again had to stop for another second because of the noise. But I, I I realized that this card was like like this and I felt like Spirit wanted me to take this one. The world branch, okay? It could, again, and this reminds me the picnic of a branch, a breakfast. I feel that mm, your soulmate is going to try to win you over always during the day. During the day I don't know why, for whatever reason, in the beginning. Maybe it's you that you don't want to go out so soon and you're starting as friends or so you're starting slowly. And again, whatever you're going to tell your soulmate, it's going to be fine for them. The world means that this is your soulmate that it's meant for you. It's meant for success. It's meant to, he or she wants to give you the whole world. They want to give you as many things as possible. They're going to try to make you very happy, okay? And I'm going to shuffle some tea leaf oracle. December, some of you, you are going to be together already in December or you have met in December. Oops. And stuff came out in group number one. Oh my gosh, guys, if you don't want, if you don't know if to choose one or two, I recommend you if you have time another day or maybe now to check group number one stuff. You will be taking care of in a, in a difficult times. Absolutely, absolutely. This soulmate is so love with you that they are going to do anything and wealth. Yes, they are going to make sure you that both of you guys you're going to have absolutely everything, okay? If it could be, I am listening, if it could be that some of you, maybe suddenly you win the lottery or you win the lottery together, you buy together the, 
the lottery i am watching it could be i am watching the 777 cash las vegas winning lottery like suddenly something unexpected and if some of you you were dealing because i am watching here prosperity twice wealth if some of you you had you were struggling with money because of patterns of family this is over okay that karma is over as well so i'm so happy for all of you all of you suddenly you're going to become very wealthy it could be that some of you maybe you're going to become viral i don't feel it's both i feel it's one of the two okay maybe some of you you feel you're going to be become very successful whatever you're going to do or you're going to pursue 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 no <laughs> pursue and marriage yes la. your soulmate knows this you don't you're not going to know it in the beginning <laughs> but they know it <laughs> Okay, my loves. And ink pot problems to be resolved. Again, this is a this is somebody that it's always going to solve any type of problem. And I feel that both of you guys are going to be very good at that. Okay, if right now you're not passing through a good moment, they are going to help you. But you have to allow your soulmate to help you. I feel group number two that sometimes it's difficult for you to allow people to help you because. You're a little bit burned out. Don't worry. Allow yourself to be helped because it's not just giving, giving, giving. There needs to be a balance. Giving and receiving. Giving and receiving. Maybe in the beginning, your soulmate's going to give you a lot. It's fine. It will, it, will, it will get a point that it will be balanced, okay, of giving and receiving. And to end of the reading. Yes, some of you, you are going to meet through scholarship, university, studies, course, a, a webinar, it could be as well, through a group, through a Facebook group, it could be as well, okay? Again, one of the two is going to be very, very, very in love with the other one, and the other, the other the heart is more little one, it's like, mm, give it time. <laughs> and let us shuffle another one. I love these postcards. Oh, look at that. Mm. What a beautiful connection. And again, your soulmate is going to win you over. It's going to win your heart. Because why? Not because of manipulation. Not because of lies. Not because of appearances. Not because I'm fake and I'm not showing myself who I am. But I'm giving you that. I think that many of you, you have passed through that with other people that they didn't show you the real you, the, sorry, the real them. And this is not the case with your soulmate. The soulmate that it's meant for you is like you. They are natural. They are very straightforward. And your soulmate is going to be very straightforward. But I feel again, if you're going to tell this person, I am in a mess right now. I need space or I need to go to slow down or I need to for us to become friends first. It's fine for them. Because they know, they know, they're going to marry you. And that's why they don't care. If you want to mark the, the rhythm in the beginning, if you want to, yes, if you want to guide the relationship to go faster, slowly, your soulmate, it's fine with that. I cannot tell you. Fine. Absolutely. My beauty is... I hope you have liked it. If that's the case, give me a like. Subscribing would help me a lot with the algorithm here on YouTube. And remember, if you want a more specific reading, which is better, for less than $2, 10 minutes. In 10 minutes, they can tell you a lot of stuff in Keen. You have my direct link down below. I'm not working in Keen, guys. As I'm offering sometimes private readings, but they're more expensive. And I know many people cannot pay that amount of money. That's why I, um, I am working with Keen in that sense. I recommend them. You guys, you receive an amazing reading. If you want to have more than 10 minutes, don't worry. It's not expensive. And yes, and all of us, we win. <laughs> My son said, Mwah! kisses from Spain. Adios. <laughs> Adios, corazones. Hi, my sweethearts. Hello, group number three, you feel so blessed. We feel so blessed for your presence. Okay, what the spirits are telling me already? You know, guys that are more of channeling. That, sorry, <laughs> that's the new member of the family. <laughs> that's Luna, <laughs> moon in Spanish. Um, what I'm listening from spirit, that many of you, the, you're the so much that it's meant for you, somebody that you already know from the past, or somebody that maybe you didn't know personally, somebody that you are 
um, following or somebody that you had a, a sort of a crush with that person and and that's why he's appearing whether it's a he or a she this energy is appearing like um, you cannot see the other half because this is letting me know that or you have just met recently or this is somebody from the past or this is somebody from a family member it could be a brother or a sister or a friend from somebody from your past it could be as well okay i'm listening for a spirit okay okay and i feel group number three that both of you guys you're going to be quite surprised with one and another Parrot is telling me that both of you guys, you are working really hard to create abundance in general. Not only money, but a great health, a great mind, a great energy, a great life, a great home, a great friends. I am listening from spirit that both of you guys, you're trying really hard to have a, a, an abundant life in general. Three of Pentacles. Okay. This one wants to come out. King of Swords. Ace of Wands. Wow. Nice. The combination I like. I like it. The Devil in Reverse. And the Ten of Swords. It was coming in reverse as well. Okay. So what is this telling me, my loves, is that this is somebody that, again, it could be, mm, it could be an ex for some of you. Well, it could be, it could be, but I don't think it's an ex that both of you guys, you were together for quite a long time because the Three of Pentacles is talking about new beginnings, somebody that is an apprentice, some, somebody that it's, have just started a new career, a new project, something new, it could be that... They have just arrived in, in in maybe some of them they are some soulmates are working in some of your of your companies it could be or some of them they're a new student and but again I feel that this if if, if it's in the next it's not more than three months okay <laughs> okay <laughs> have to be sincere and again this is somebody that both of you guys you are going to Feel very curious for one and another. We see the two characters watching the young man showing his project, showing his product. I feel that your soulmate is trying to sell out a product that they feel it's going to become really abundant and successful. And it's taking them time. It could be that some of you, you're trying to create your own business and it's taking you time. But with the Ace of Wands, this is letting me know that you and your soulmate, both of you guys are very similar, the way you interact with people, the way you operate in life, the way you embrace life, the way you embrace opportunities. I feel that both of you guys, like the King of Swords and the, the Ace of Wands, you know that if you go for it, you can, you can get it. I think that both of you, you're really brave. I think that both of you, you're very similar. I think that even, it could be that some of you could be like a sort of a twin flame connection. It could be, okay? Or it could look like and again i feel that your soulmate is somebody that they are very hard working if they are i f even feel that some of them i'm listening from spirit they come from a wealthy family but they wanted to start from the bottom okay they didn't want to have any type of advantage because the dad or the mom is the owner of the company or has a big influence in the company or in the university that both of you guys, you're studying, okay? This is somebody that does not show off. This is somebody that even I was listening, now it makes sense. I was listening from spirit that your soulmate probably does not give a lot of... Well, this is for some, okay? Because again, I was listening that some of them or some of you, you're trying to really create abundance out of a project that you have just started, okay? But I, I feel another half of this reading, <laughs> sorry guys, because I'm listening to a lot of messages. I feel that some of them, they were, they're coming from a wealthy family, but again, they want to start from zero. They want to show, not show off, they want to show that they are worth it of that job, of that project, and they can do it. That's why the devil in reverse, for me, 
you know guys that are more into the reader reading or reader okay that's why the ten of swords and the devil on reverse i feel that they are very good managing pressure they are very good managing um, people that have envy towards them they are very good at managing toxic people they are very good at managing difficult situations and I've, I've never felt soulmates like in this reading and in this group that are so good at dealing with toxicity. They are very good. They can see from far away who is, who is pure of heart, who is not, who is dark, who is light, who is working themselves, who is trying, but you know, they're very good at that. They know they're like a walking eye detector. I am listening. They're very good at that. And I feel that right now they're very strong. Maybe it could be that in the past they were in an addiction. It could be that some of them, they had an addiction with sex. They had an addiction with drugs, smoking, alcohol. They had an addiction of working too many hours. Or they had an addiction of going out too many times or spending too much time on playing games in the computer and social media, whatever. And this on reverse, this is letting me know that whatever uh, addiction they went through, it's over. Okay, so this is somebody that um, right now is very focused. And the Ace of Wands, this is telling me that it's completely, the soulmate is meant for you. And that nobody is going to be able to break this relationship. I think that this is a message for some of you. Maybe you passed through certain situations that... People that were not meant to do anything in your relationships, they did that. That's why the King of Swords, I feel that many people that were very mental, and I know this is Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, and I'm Aquarius. <laughs> These are thoughts. Uh, I feel that many people try to break up your stories or are trying to, are not supporting your dreams right now. And I feel that both of you guys, you are going to be very supportive with one and another. Both of you guys, you are going to really support the dream of one and another. And you're going to fight for this connection, for this relationship. You're not going to allow any bullshit, any toxicity coming into the relationship. And if some of you, you're de still dealing with anxiety or any type of addiction, I feel that your soulmate is going to fight for you, is going to help you, is going to travel the whole world if they need to get a shaman, a healer, a great therapist, as maybe you need, because you're dealing with some health issues, and I'm sorry about that, but don't worry, it, it will get better, I'm listening. This is the type of person, your soulmate, that will travel for 24 hours to get a specific doctor for you, the best doctor for you. The best therapist for you, the best healer for you. This is the type of soulmate that you are attracting. That's wonderful. Yes, and Seven of Cups. Okay. This is somebody that I have to be sincere. I, and I think this is like all of you guys. All of you guys, you always have people that are interested in you, but normally you're not very interested in all of them, in <laughs> most of them. And it happens the same with your soulmate. I feel that like, again, both of you guys, you have passed, if not through the same situations, both of you guys, you're very similar. The way you feel, the way you respond to situations, to people, the way you cut relationships that are not good for you, the way you cut people when they're being rude, the way you cut whatever, really. Both of you guys, you're very good at that. And good for you. Good for you. That's having a high self-esteem. And at the back, eight of wands. So I feel that... Uh, from the moment you guys you meet one and another and you start going out I feel that in eight months one of the two is going to say to the other one it could be less okay because this is a general reading but I feel that most of you guys if not all you're going to live together already in eight months since the moment you guys you know each other beautiful <laughs> and I'm listening that your soulmate is going to tell you oh my gosh you're so beautiful you're beautiful honey beautiful like very nice phrases and if you're a man you're so sexy you're so handsome what oh you're my man you know like very beautiful talk between both of you guys very nice talk yes 17 yes 
It's like, for me, it represents the Knight of Cups, okay? And we have number 20, the Rose. A lot of romance, a lot of romanticisms. And I feel that both of you guys, you're going to walk together. You're going to... Again, one of the two is dealing with something from the past. The other one is going to support. And I was feeling that very similar, like group number two. I feel that this, if you want to meet a man, he's a gentleman. And if you want to meet a woman, she's very elegant, okay? I feel like... You're going to see him like a king or you're going to see her like a queen. Or maybe that's going to be the word like in Spanish is rey, reina. I mean, it could be done in English. Oh, my, my king. Or oh, I don't know if they say that in English. Did they say my king? <laughs> I don't think. No, my god, my goddess. Yes, <laughs> that's better. Oh, my god. Oh, my goddess. I mean, no, very, very interesting the way both of you guys, you're going to talk to one another, the way you, you play. I see a lot of playfulness, but the moment both of you guys, you have more confidence because you're not the type of person that you open up easily to, uh, to anyone. You need to feel that you can trust that person and that's fine. I feel that both of you guys are very similar in that sense. Let's go for some Oracle. I feel that both of you guys, and again, you're going to write Maybe one of the two has a motors, a motorbike, or has a horse. Or both of you guys, you would love, you would love to live in the countryside and have horses and many type of animals. Truth, yes, Raven Spirit. This is magic. This is power and truth. So this is a real connection. This is your true soulmate. This is the soulmate that it's meant for you. And I think that both of you guys, you have already met through your dreams. You have already connected. And success. Yes, yeah, secret spring. Many of you, you're going to meet by springtime. Okay. And it's going to become a very successful love story. Very successful. Like a kind of fairy tale story. I feel that one of the two likes unicorns and fairies. So there's a very special connection. Maybe when you were a child, you loved fairies, or maybe that's your soulmate. I sense a lot of connection with animals here in group number three. It could be that some of them or some of you, you're vets, or you have a lot of animals, or both of you guys, you're going to have animals as well as kids. It could be. Rabbit. Yes, sensitive soul. I'm going to... Sensitive soul, strengthen your boundaries and cut cords. Yes. So both of you guys, you are beginning to feel you're lucky and that luck is in your side. The moment you, you started to cut with people that were so toxic and addicted and very manipulative with you. I think that both of you guys, you passed through this. And that's why cutting away, cutting... Um, cutting addictions, cutting attitudes or patterns that you were still repeating from family, from ancestors that were not healthy for you, and this is happening to your soulmate as well, that has led you, my darling, to a very lucky, to a very prosperous destiny in future. I see a lot of rabbits, so this is again a lot of animals, it could be a lot of kids for some of you, even even 10 kids, <laughs> okay? And again, a lot of luck, this is destiny, this is success, this is success with the rabbit, which is the representation of good luck and playfulness and a lot of joy and yes, a lot of fun. I think that many of you, you have been receiving the rabbit like the sign of good luck. And again, the horse is looking to the back. It could be some connections, one of the two. Yes, both of you guys, you are exes. Okay, but not in a long, long, long relationship. Ladybird, again, another symbol of good luck. Wow. Oh my gosh. I think that both of you guys, you're going to, to bring one to another great luck together. Because when you connect with somebody that it's light and it's meant for you, it's like, whoa, more blessings, good luck, everything flows, everything's fine. Oh my gosh, what an incredible life. All of your manifesting positive thoughts and visualizations have been heard. Yes, I'm so happy for all of you. 
Oh, look at this starfish. Representation of the star success. Destiny meant in the stars. Sorry, meant. <laughs> yes. Meant. Meant. This is your soulmate that it's meant for you. Intuition. Listen to your soul's truth. Think less, feel more. So I feel that both of you guys, you're going to think less and feel more with one and another. Oh my gosh. Isn't that amazing? I was showing the unicorn. Look at that, golden unicorn, ascension, awaken to your soul's potential. Wow, both of you guys, you're going to live an incredible life. An incredible life. I think that even some of you, they're going to make a movie, they're going to write about your love story. <laughs> it's going to be, I am listening, it's going to be epic. This love story, it's going to be epic. Wow. I'm so happy for all of you guys because after that, those rough times and those rough people and people maybe that have bullied you or have bullied your soulmate. Oh my gosh, you're going to feel... I think that many of you, you're starting to feel grateful and that's why both of you guys, you're coming together because when we feel grateful, it's great energy, it's high vibration and we attract easily. And, you're, and it's going to be very easy for you to forgive all of these people that were very mean to you. And if that's not your case, then it's your soulmate's case. Okay, my loves? Let's send me to show the one in the back. I will do it, okay? Feel the mouse. Success! Oh my gosh! Believe in yourself and dare to dream big. Yes! Oh my gosh! Really, guys, whatever you're trying to manifest with this partner, with this soulmate meant for you, it's going to be very successful. It's going to be very successful. I feel that... Both of you guys, you were meant to be happy, to raise the vibration of planet Earth, maybe to do projects to help grow more trees, to help Mother Gaia, to help animals, to help kids. Maybe some of you, you're working with kids, or you're meant to work with kids, with children, with new generations. And I feel that both of you guys, you are completely star seeds. That's why the starfish. And I feel that many of you, you're from Atlantis as well, and indigo, because I'm watching a lot of blue. Okay, and Lemurian, I'm watching a lot of yellow. So Lemurian, many of you are Lemurian from Atlantis. Yes, I'm feeling the energy, moving in my energy when I'm talking about Lemurian and Andromedan and Pleiadians. Well, I'm watching a little bit of everything here because it's many of you. Pleiadians, Pleiadians, Andromedans. If you're receiving a lot of feathers, for sure, you're working with Andromedans. Um, and some of you Arcturians even, I'm listening. Wow, amazing. Air element, yes, with the king of swords, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Both of you guys, you're very quick at receiving information from spirit. So I think that both of you guys, you're natural channelers. You're very good at listening. You are great listeners. You know how to read emotions in people. Probably, if not all, most of you guys, you're highly empaths. You're highly sensitive to energy. I think that many of you, even you're perceiving messages from the wind. You have that ability. I don't know if you know about these guys, but some people have the ability to listen to trees, to listen to the wind. And I think this is one of the abilities that are going to be discovered. It could be if it's not that, maybe some of you, you're going to start writing, writing, I'm listening, drawing, texting, something creating something that it's going to become really successful and it's going to help a lot of people okay maybe it's your love story maybe uh, you have to talk about this connection so you can help others find the way find the path and at the back aquarius and we have here mars okay both of you guys you have passed through a lot of tough situations and you have overcome all of them and Venus at the back as well. I sense a lot of sensuality. Not so much. I'm not telling you guys that you're not going to. I was going to say, yes, sex is going to be amazing, but I sense like more sensuality, more sensuality. Everything more slowly, sensual, sensual. I don't sense like rough sex and quickly and... And that's amazing. Some of you love it. Yes, of course. But I feel like sensual, sensual. Uh, the way they touch, I even sense that one of the two is very good at 
uh, giving massages, touching. Uh, there's something about the touch. I feel that both of you guys, you're always going to hold hands very quickly in the beginning. And yes, very nice. I sense like a very beautiful touch between both of you. Go for it! Yes, new moon in Aries and new moon in Libra. Know you're loved. This came out in group number one, I believe so. So again, yes, both of you guys, you're going to love one another so much and you are always going to go for whatever activity, project, adventure, travel, moving to a different place, whatever both of you guys you feel, you're not really, you are not afraid. Ah, yes, I didn't say it in the beginning. Both of you guys, you're really brave very brave and look at the back be real aquarius again okay Air element uh both of you guys you're real you're not fake you're real you're the real this is the real stuff this is the real deal this is the real love that you have always been waiting for group number three and i'm so 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 happy for you you deserve this absolutely my love an ascension yes ascension some of you, you're going to meet in six months, between six weeks and six months. Okay, my loves? An ascension. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. Both of you guys, you are going to raise your vibration, even being together. I am listening. Let's shuffle some tea leaf oracle. This was my gift for my birthday. <laughs> One of my gifts. Shield. You need to defend yourself. And again, I feel that both of you guys, you're coming from a past that you felt that you needed to defend yourself a lot because there were too many toxicity, toxic people trying to F you up, <laughs> fool you. And that it's over. Don't worry because both of you guys, you understand one another and that is over. That's what I'm listening from spirit. That it's over. Don't worry. And bull, do not back down from opposition. Show strength and fortitude. Again, this is telling, talking about both of you guys. Maybe some of you, it's your Taurus or your soulmate is Taurus, okay? It could be a, a mix of earth element and, yes, and air element. So both of you guys, you, had, you have passed through a lot. But again, that has made you who you are today. Strong, wise, mature. You are now vibrating from unconditional love. And pin, new job and career. Yes. So maybe some of you, you're going to meet this person when you are starting a new job, a new career, or maybe they're starting a new career, a new path, a new project. Okay, my loves. And I feel that there's no secrets between both of you guys. You're going to know the pin of his mobile or her mobile, and they're going to know the pin of everything, your passwords, and I don't sense none of the two looking, <laughs> searching for emails. No, I sense that both of you guys, you really trust one another. And look at the back, Jack. Lighthearted, carefree time. Yes. But both of you guys, you're going to really take care of that heart that has been so hurt in the past. Okay, that's why I sense so much sensuality and something very beautiful the way I, I sense dancing maybe some of you you're going to meet through dance classes dancing or maybe both of you guys you're going to dance very on the first date march okay many of you you're going to meet in march in springtime yes because we were i was watching before spring and fire element again uh, ah, no, this is, this is new. Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. Strong emotion, passionate love or hate? I don't think it's hate. I think that this is going to be a very passionate connection. But again, I feel it like smooth, like slowly. Like, not slowly, like sensual. Yes. Career comes out again. Career is coming out a lot of times in these readings. And married, yes, like group number two, and star, yes, both of you guys, your star seats, and probably both of you, you're going to end up in a very beautiful, romantic, and long-lasting and long -lasting married. Oh my gosh, I'm so happy for all of you. Wow. My sweeties, I'm going to shuffle some images. What a beautiful reading. I love soulmates readings. 
always gives me like very good vibration. Look at that. Oh. Some of you you're going to meet through studies or through a group of studying or through a book, or through a group of reading. It could be a reading a group. Okay, but I sense... Yes, nice. The, the way both of you guys you're going to approach one another is going to be very in a very nice and pure way. I don't see like playing games to to get you or to get your soulmate. I sense like very natural approach, very nice. I sense your soulmate is very polite as well. <laughs> Look at that. A lot of a lot of okay, one of the two is going to adore to scare the other one to make maybe your soulmate is going to adore to do that to you so it makes you laugh. Okay. Ah, uh, look at that, both of you guys having a nice breakfast, reading your newspaper, reading something that you have just wrote in. I see a lot of writers here in group number three. And again, being very peaceful in that area, sacred area, magical area with a lot of nature around you. And again, I sense sensuality. I sense, I sense that both of you guys, you're going to have a lot of different moments of uh, having fun, learning something together, studying something together. Mm, silences are not going to be uncomfortable, not at all. And look at the restaurant. Oh my gosh, the battery. Look at the restaurant. I love you. Yes. Oh my gosh. One of the two is going to adore to give flowers to the other one. Very, one of the two is very good at writing. Okay, it could be that both of you guys, you're very good at writing, communicating. Communication is the key. I sense I am watching France or like a sort of. A, in Spanish is uh, panaderia, hostelería, somewhere where you can have a nice coffee or eat uh, some nice food. Again, I say I sense romance and I sense going to places that it, they are not too crowded. I don't feel you guys you like to be in crowded places because you are highly sensitive to energy. I'm not telling you that you cannot adapt yourselves to places where there's people, but. Both of you guys, you like to be together in a sort of cocoon. And yes, you trust one another. You trust one another because you know, both of you guys, that this is meant to be. And that both of you guys, you're real, that this connection is real. Wow, group number three, I hope you have liked it. I have loved it. That's the case, please don't forget to subscribe, give me a like, and again, if you want a more specific reading, you just have to spend less than $2. You have 10 minutes. You have a lot of time to receive a lot of information. I am not working in Keen, but I'm offering Keen because my readings are more expensive. And that's a way just spending $2 is nothing, $1.99. And you can get to this incredible offer from Keen. And you have such a big list of psychic statutes, mediums that are very good in Keen. And you will receive more specific details. Mwah, my angels, I love you. <laughs> Bye, my loves. Bye.